Hi, uh, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a light using a VHS tape thingy. So this is a nice little retro room decor thing that I'm going to do for you. And it's a really simple tutorial as well. So this is going to be the first of three um, tutorials I'm going to use uh, cassettes with, uh, not cassettes, tapes with. So obviously you're going to need one. This is, like, you've probably got some up in your loft somewhere or charity shops doing them really cheaply. So you're going to need this case bit for a different tutorial, but today we don't need it. We're going to use this part of the tape. So they come apart really easily, it's just usually about five screws on the back which you unscrew. It's just a normal Phillips screwdriver you're going to need, nothing fancy. So you just unscrew them and the back easily just pops off. So you take that off and there you have the actual tape and someone didn't rewind this, so annoying. <laughs> um, so now this bit takes actually quite a long time, so you're going to want to take off the the actual that film bit. And I'm going to use that for another tutorial as well, so I'm, I'm literally using everything in this, so I'm not wasting anything. And if you want to use that, I would suggest, as you're unwinding it, wrapping it around something so it's all nice and neat. If not, you end up with a big massive mess on the floor. And just in case, if you are really young, you don't even know what these are, this is what we had before streaming and DVDs. <laughs> That's what we used to watch movies with. You used to have to sit in front of the TV if you wanted something recorded and actually press the record button. And to get back to the beginning, you have to rewind it. <laughs> So this is what it's like after it's all done. Then you're going to need some of these little micro LED lights. They're not like the normal lights I use. These are just like the ones with little tiny spots of light. Little tiny ones. So I got these from Poundland, so they're not expensive lights or anything. So I'm going to stick a bit of sellotape onto one end and stick that to the middle of one of these round thingamajigs. And then I'm just going to wrap those are lights around the middle. So there's only 10 lights on this one so I've wrapped 5 around that one and then I'm going to carefully wrap it around the other one as well. You want it so the lights are on like the outsides of the, the I can't explain it, do you know that middle circle bit? You want the lights so they're, so they're not facing the middle if you can get them on that edge because that's the bit where it's actually going to shine through the other side of the cassette not cassette, why do I keep calling it a cassette? <laughs> it's a VHS tape thingy <laughs> okay so once you've done that you're then just going to sellotape the wire out of the way and then this wire you just pull it down and there's a little like kind of gap can easily be threaded through and when you put the top on the gap shows at the back so it's not covered up or anything. So you just pop the cover back on and then get those screws and put them back in. And you're pretty much done. That is it if you've got the coloured lights. If you don't have coloured lights you can just use white lights and there is a way of using white lights but making them colourful as well. So what's left to do is add the batteries, and this is optional, but if you want it, the batteries to like stay in place in the back, just get some velcro, stick it on the battery pack, and then stick it onto the tape. You can just pop it behind the battery pack behind the light, so you don't need to stick it on, but I think it just balances the tape a bit better. And this is what it looks like. It looks a whole lot better in the dark though, <laughs> so this doesn't actually show it that well. You obviously saw it right at the beginning anyway. So this is what I'm doing with the clear lights. I'm taking some of this coloured foil and I'm literally just going to stick it on top of that clear round bit. And that's it. <laughs> that's all I'm doing. I'm just going to stick it on there, cut off any excess and then put the cassette thing back on the front like I would normally. And it creates a colourful one, just in case we've got colourful lights. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it, bye!